Um, as you get into the pros, what do you feel that your strengths are right now heading into the NFL? And what are the things that you feel you need to work on to really succeed at the next level? Uh, being able to go and play man-to-man, -man, especially in the slot. Um, something that I've worked on in this offseason and I know that I need to improve to be able to stay and become a guy in the league is, is being able to shed blocks, get off blocks, and make a play like that. Go ahead, George. Yeah, hey, Kerry, uh, congratulations. Uh, can you explain to us uh, your reasoning for opting out this last year? Uh, and then also, you I believe you went up against Jerry Judy. Uh, what was going up against him like? Uh, so I, I've been through this process a while. Everybody's asked me uh, who, who's the best receiver I guarded going through uh, my college career, and I told them all Jerry Judy. And, um, you know, he's just one of those guys. And uh, I look forward to, you know, practicing against him and uh, making each other better. And uh, secondly, um, I opted out this past season due to the uncertainty and the other disease. Uh, it was big at that time. I honestly didn't think we were going to have a season. Um, I got it myself. Um, I contracted the symptoms twice, got tested twice. Nobody knew what was going on. But, um, yeah, that was the reason for me not playing this year. Go ahead, Ryan O'Hell. Hey, Kerry, uh, national championship two years ago. What made that defense and what made that secondary so special? Uh, our chemistry uh, off the field, I feel, uh, not even just a week. And I just go back, and um, that was the first time I was a part of a team like that. We all just – we all literally loved each other. When we, when we weren't playing football, we were around each other. So in our off time, we were with each other. And I feel like that chemistry just – it was just um, it was just something that you – it was a once-in-a-lifetime thing, I feel. Go ahead, Nick. Gary, there's a lot of fast guys in the NFL, but not a lot that run, you know, almost 10 flat 100 yard dashes what was track like going professionally in track ever a real consideration for you uh track was never anything i really just loved i always was just good at track so i'm i'm sorry if i'm breaking up my phone blowing up um my school just gave me the opportunity to do it so i did it i was just always good at it i never really loved track i just did it because i felt it, i love to compete and it was just something that i can i could compete at and i have fun doing it. we'll go final one zach stevens Gary, you said your phone's blowing up. What what have these past you know, couple hours been like for you and going through this draft process to have it be to have it you be drafted? Uh, first off, it's it's an honor to be drafted. I know a lot of guys don't make it here. A lot of people, a lot of people didn't think I'd make it this far. Uh, going this late is just really a humbling experience, and I mean, it's really, it's really. I'm just so hungry to just. I'm glad that you guys have given me the opportunity. I'm I'm just ready to. I'm ready to work. I'm ready to get there and work.